We have the annual chrism mass, which is when the bishop blesses all the oils for the, for the diocese. And it's also uh, the mass where all the priests for the diocese get together and they, they renew their, their vows that they took at their ordination. I'll be at the chrism mass um, serving. I guess when I was really young, I mean, one of the first things I wanted to be was a priest. Dad brought it up when he asked Mike, Michael, he was like, you gonna become a priest one day? And Mike, Mike went, no, I'm not, I'm never gonna become a priest. I don't think really seriously I ever thought about it. I guess the extent to, to which I could have seen myself being a priest was just wondering what it would be like being up there, but I never really had a desire um, to be up there. The turning point came during my junior year of college when I was at UConn. I went on a mission trip to Kentucky and um, I sort of went in not really knowing why I was doing it, um, but the students that I met that I was working with during that week, they were sort of just radiating this joy and this, this pride that they had for their faith and the fact that they, they were talking about Jesus like he was a real person who you could have a relationship with. It struck me as, as weird and a little strange at first um, because I had never really encountered people like that who were my own age, but they really, their witness really resonated with me. And it was something that, that I knew that they had that I didn't have and that I didn't have in my life. He had been kind of traveling around and kind of, I think, feeling it out. Then when he said, I think I've made my decision to, I'm gonna apply to the seminary. I was very, very excited and very proud. We all were. It makes my wife and I proud to see that, you know, hopefully we've done a good job. And, you know, there's, there's a lot of bad in the world. And, you know, he's, he's pursuing something that, that's good. The biggest problem I'm going to have is looking at him and calling my son father. To know that people are out there and that they were made for, for knowing God and encountering him, um, and being with him for all eternity ultimately really inspires me to get outside of myself and be challenged because it is a mission, the priesthood's a mission um, where you give of yourself to the point that, that there's nothing left in you so that God can, can provide what is, what is lacking in you. And so whether he's, he's calling me to be a priest or he's calling me to marriage, I know that Whatever his will for me is my highest and ultimate good.